All right, guys, and welcome back. My name is D-Free, and for today's video, we are taking a look at Green Kefla. And if you guys want to see a Red Kefla revisit, post down below in the comments, hit a thumbs up, and uh, if we get over 25 comments saying to do it, then I'll do it. Just say, hey, D-Free, do the Red Kefla video. The reason I ask and say is because I never liked that character much. As much as I like Kefla as a character, um, I just never liked the Red Kefla. I didn't like her playstyle. I didn't really care for her, things like that. Anyways... This Kefla is a completely different story. You know, I recorded the entirety of this video and I came to the conclusion that this Kefla was way ahead of her time. This Kefla was way ahead of her time. Like, she's not good now, right? She obviously needs an uptick in stats. You know, she needs a Zenkai. I mean, she's old. What old character that's two plus years old doesn't need a Zenkai? Um, she needs a Zenkai. She, but the point is, she does things in her kit that are, like, really strong still. Um, especially, the most important things and vital things are, for one, she nullifies endurance here. She has faint here. This is still a really solid ultimate. Minus 100% to sustain damage. This is still a really solid ultimate effect. Like, it just, hands down, still solid. Nothing special, but solid. Uh, she has the on-entry draw, or changes blast to strikes. She has uh, draw speed, I believe, throughout her kit. I'm pretty sure she does. She has the blast armor. She's a high tempo, high offense character. She has support in her kit, the healing based on damage she takes. You know, the funny thing is uh, green 21 is going to, she has extra damage to Goku, so that's going to age well, always has. Uh, the funny thing is like green 21 is getting a Zenkai and they're adding some like that, what that effect where you heal. Yeah, right here. It stores 20% of damage uh, up to 20% of health, right? They're adding that type of effect there. And I'm like, dude, these are very similar characters. Just one's a strike-based character, one's a blast-based character. But that's neither here nor there. Um, extra damage here. So she basically, she's so old, her Z ability is so bad. Like, this is how old Kefla is. <laughs> she got a single stat Z ability. Dude, she came out before the two-year anniversary. She was so ahead of her time. <laughs> Seriously. So... Here's the deal. I'm going to talk throughout the video about the thing, so I'm not going to just, I'm not going to talk about it much longer, but I do think Kefla has a solid chance of either getting a Zenkai, that'll be the red one probably, um, because they may not even think this Kefla needs a Zenkai right now for the record. Um, how many of you guys still use this character? Let me know. But I also think there's a solid chance that a new Kefla or, or an LF21, I think those are the top two options I have right now, come out next month. Assuming that the LF is something tied into the stuff we've been seeing recently, which is Androids, Universal Rep, you know, it's going to be around Valentine's Day, which they don't, oh, they don't do Valentine's stuff as an LF, but if they wanted to finally give us a, a girl's LF that's not tagged 17 18, then we can get that done. It is, and before it's a rear brand. <laughs> so, anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoy. Today's video like goal is, what, 800? Here we go. All right, let's give this a go. Look at this cannon matchup. Nearly cannon matchup. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow your roll there, buddy. Give me that 50% early. Give me that 50% early. Oh, there it is. And got the key down. Could have just stayed with that. Don't know why I didn't. All right, we're good. Actually, no, I couldn't have. And I know why I didn't. Because instinctually, I knew I, I couldn't stay with that. Ha! Take that, wrong D-free. Wait. What, am, what, what are you trying to say? We're, we're both wrong? Nani? What am I even talking about? <laughs> <laughs> just be saying stuff sometimes, but sometimes I just be saying stuff. Wow, I don't know why I freaking stopped that. Sometimes I just be saying stuff, bro. <laughs> All right. Ooh, Ooh you thick, thick, ain't you, girl? You're supposed to switch. Okay, maybe I got lucky that it didn't switch. Ooh, I'll take that. I was gonna say that Kefla is gonna be okay as well, because she's got the mechanic to change blasts into strikes. So she directly invalidates two things: Gogeta's mechanic about the the blast cards, and she invalidates blast-based cover changes. <laughs> it's actually not a bad match for Kefla overall. What is that? I'll take that while also having blast armor. She could be such a strong character. She can easily be a super duper strong character. Could have stayed with that. 
Yeah, give her a Zenkai and she is ridiculous. You can see it already. Like that that's the first time I've used her in months, but like she has the baseline. Like like she's got everything that you she's got the crazy support, she's got some solid healing, she's got some solid base damage. She has uh, the changing of cards, which is ridiculously strong. However, it does suck requisitely versus characters that have strike-based cover changes, because if they don't give her a special cover change nullification, then she's extremely predictable. There are downsides to the flipping of your cards like that. But, uh, you know, she's got Blast Armor. She, 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 she's a high-tempo character. That's why she dominated the way she did. She was way ahead of her time. So let's play our next match and see how that one goes. Oh, look at Kefla. Oh, yeah, look at him. Just gonna just rip those batar earrings off of you. Oh, my God. I'm gonna turn you back into two girls. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Where is this going? I don't know. Is this supposed to be some sort of innuendo? It's not. I'm just being stupid. I'm being funny. I hope it's funny. It's probably very cringe. And if it's cringe, I hope you cringe and, and cringe painfully. Very painfully. Wee, 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 wee. Okay, back to the video. Bye. Oh boy, it's beast. Ooh, but it won't do much. Uh, ooh, did good damage. I was gonna say won't do enough. He's neutral though, isn't he? That's very bad. Her support and healing though is offsetting it in a nice way. Ooh, okay, okay, we got a tough one on our hands, boys. All right, I like the challenge. Okay. So Vegito ate that. We're good. Just gotta watch out for like rushes. I'll take that. I could have actually got that with Gogeta, but I'll take this. It's a Goku switch, right? Just gonna stall here. That may not. Ah, I was hoping he would have destroyed the strike. Okay, cool. He gave me the, the out there by doing the tackle. Perfect vanish. Beast Gohan? No way. I didn't think so. I didn't think so. That's fine too, though. That's why I called Beast. I was like, I only don't want to see Beast. I don't care if this guy switches in. Eat that. Good play. I was going to say, but he has no cards, though, so... <laughs> so... <laughs> the natural inclination is to just do the sidestep after. Oof. Oof. Lot. God damn, this one's already over. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Knock it on wood. Don't let me call it and get destroyed because Gogeta's still a menace over there. I see you, boy. I I'm out of that. Wait. Yeah, he got priority because he did a blue. That's why I said, wait a minute. <laughs> Hold up. Oh, okay. <laughs> like I said, he's still a menace. Class A menace. It's far from over, though, but he's a class A menace. Got him. He tried to drop combo on me. Destroyed my cards, though. Cute. Look at him, class A menace, just playing the game for this guy. Actually, just playing the game for this guy. Oh, that's a GG, right? There we go, okay. It, I didn't say that to, by the way, take a knock at the guy. It's just, Gogeta did everything like automatically there. Like, it's just, <laughs> all right, let's play the next one. Just do everything for you nowadays. Me too, for everybody. They just, they just do things, they just make it happen. I'm cool with it. Surprised there was no switch. Probably was too last second for him. Oh my god. Like strike, like cover null right here would be ridiculous. Especially because she also gets the extra damage when she uses cards. Also, if that gets converted to just being damage, not only strike damage, I don't think they will. And it doesn't really matter as much because she forces strikes into her hand. It's just her blasts are dead, right? But there's just a lot of things that are in Kefla's kit that are crazy strong still. 
that will age like fine wine. Because she has eight. I'm going to do this instead. It's going to drop the combo, but whatever. Because she has age like fine wine. You know? She's got that stuff in her kit. That's so powerful. Perfect. Yeah, I know. I messed that up. But all's well that ends well, because you're gone. And welcome back. Didn't last long, did it, Gohan? Okay. Uh, I want to wait for Kefla. She's one count off. Can I get a tap punch here just to stall? Literally, I just need one count. There it is. Perfect. Ooh, oh, I got the perfect, too. I was set up for a perfect vanish. But the AoE stupid green, man. I really, uh, the reason why I wanted to do that is because I want to see Kefla versus this guy, right? This Vegito offers support when he's hit, right? He's a new, new Zen Kai that I never really cared much about. I'm pretty sure he does. Ooh, good patient. I might get burned there. Yep, I did. She doesn't nullify, but I was going to say, I don't know if he's going to throw the blue here or what. Don't die, please. That heal, still nice. Another AoE green. There it is. There, I knew it. So I stopped sidestepping right there. I was like, there's going to be another green right here. Tackle. Ooh. There we go. This is where, again, her having the ability to nullify a pan cover change would be nice. I know this guy kind of doesn't want to do it, is what it looks like. Because he has advantage, right? And that's smart. But still. This will eliminate Gohan, I think. Okay. I was hoping to see it. The debuffs from Pan is going to make this hit really weak. She just reduced the crit, all that stuff. Wow, that still did more damage than I thought it would. Didn't get the faint, though. Oh, I messed that up. Still was able to recover. Yeah, 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 not bad. Rush? Okay. I was like, he's, he's gonna just rush here? Uh, but I didn't really care, because it's freaking Kefla. Like, I care from the perspective of the video, but, like, we gonna act like I don't have freaking Gogeta Blue sitting back there? Like, <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> okay. Okay. Bye. I, I was gonna like do the same thing back to him where you stand still and just rush when they hit you But instead I was like, I know he's gonna try to tackle me. So I'm just gonna go for this strike So yeah, Kefla looked okay in that match. It was nice to see her from that perspective versus older characters I'm Gonna assume this is a new reroll account or something um, Because all these Zenkais were released in this time period and these characters and stuff So yeah here we go. All right, here we go. So he's clearly not going to switch. He did switch. He must have thought I was switching. But no, if he thought I was switching, then I would have gone to a purple. So I don't know why he switched. Anyways, whatever. Whatever. I'll take this opportunity. He should have just stayed. I forced him to switch a second time. <laughs> Multiple times. 17's already on his second entry, though, so he's already destroying a Dragon Ball. It's not great. Those hits did spike Kefla's damage for the support and stuff. Uh, so there's that. But also, look how she healed right after. She healed basically a, a decent amount of that damage right back. Ah, I was thinking he'd go for a blast instantly. Maybe he still does. Ah, nope. I'll have to cancel this one. I'm going to tap punch here just to stall. This guy getting eaten alive by the blast armor. I'm not going to switch to Kefla yet. That was why. <laughs> Look at how much health these guys have, though. God dang. <laughs> They're just chilling at max HP permanently. Goodness, man. Right, I got to get one of these guys up out of here, dude. Look at the blast difference. Now, she has all blast-based equips. The Z abilities are, I tried to give like double attack, so it's, it, blast is there, some some spots, but it's mainly strike attack. Uh, but the blast damage is just not it. <laughs> Whew, 
He takes a whopping amount of damage. Is he gonna switch again? Okay, I was gonna say, like, is he gonna do that same situation as earlier? Got a perfect there. I'm gonna pull this. If I get the faint, then I'm gonna be in a crazy position because I could just switch an ult. Oh, he, he better hope I don't get that faint. I don't know. I don't think they're immune. He better hope I don't get the faint because he just did a terrible switch if I do. I did. That was the worst possible switch, dude. I'm not gonna waste any time. I'm gonna eliminate them right here and now. That was the worst possible switch he could have done. He had type advantage. Look at, they were already at zero or one. Wow. <laughs> wow. That faint kicked in and just completely won the game. Well, we're not out of the woods yet, but it looks like they, that's why I said we're not out of the woods yet, because I realized that I just got beat there. Uh, but it looks like that faint won this game, dude. We'll see. 17 is a better character than than uh, Super Vegito, I think. But I don't know that in the position I'm in, I'm going to lose. We'll see. All right. So let's do the recap. Kefla was awesome. Not really so much uh, for, for some of her damage. Her damage sometimes is okay, but... Unless she's got type advantage, her damage will be nothing special. She's just old. That's normal. Um, she takes a lot to get going. She needs to ramp up. She needs to use those strikes, get the extra damage from those, stuff like that. She, like, it's mandatory that a character like Kefla gets cover nullification. It's it's mandatory. She can't, there's no debate about it. She needs it. She It's mandatory. So if and or when she gets a Zenkai Awakening, I hope that they do that. That is at the top of my list. Uh, I also would like for her to get some more cut added into her. We need, she needs more damage and cut, yes. Uh, some more key would be nice too. These are all like, these are all things that became a lot more relevant and common after, you know, she came out, right? Cause she came out at a point where cover nullification, wait a minute, cover nullification didn't exist when Kefla came out. I'm pretty sure LF Vegito Blue, if I remember correctly, was the very first cover nullification character. And his was only on his ultimate. And he came out after Kefla. So I'm pretty sure it just didn't... Dude, Kefla was way ahead of her time. If, if I'm remembering the timeline right, Kefla and Vegito Blue, for that record, they dominated this game something fierce because they were so ahead of their time, man. So yeah, Kefla's got some stuff that, that I think aged really well, and, and if she gets a Zenkai with modern stats and some minor tweaks that bring her to modern levels, I, I, I don't see why she wouldn't be probably at least better than SS4 Gogeta, for example. And with the stuff we have going on with all the girls stuff, Valentine's Day around the corner, Rival Universe, not Rival Universe, but Universal Rep, like a new Kefla or, or a Kefla Zenkai are on the table. These are things that I think either or or of those things has a solid chance of happening watch it be a freaking red kefla dude i never liked the red kefla i think i've done one video on her ever ever if you want to see the red kefla revisit post down below in the comments if we get 25 comments saying do it i'll do it <laughs> anyways hit that thumbs up and subscribe and if you want to see a video where i go more in depth about the possibility the potential of a new LF Kefla releasing. Click the video on your screen right now. I'll see you in the next one.